Hey there, travelers. Welcome back. Go anywhere cool on your vacation? Like the tropical rainforests of Indonesia, Papua New Guinea, or eastern parts of Australia? Because if you did, you might have seen this week's animal, the birds of paradise. Now, birds of paradise are known for their beautiful array of feathers, which they use to attract the females. You think they dig me? Now, those gorgeous tails may look beautiful, but they're not very helpful for flight. Instead, they're used to help males show off any number of dance moves to attract the females and outdo the rivals. Some species will dance in trees, while others will create a stage on the forest floor by stripping away leaves, letting the sunlight shine down on them. Nature's fashion show. Yeah. Birds of paradise are known to be the most attractive and dramatic birds on planet Earth. Like many bird species, the female bird of paradise looks dull in comparison to their male counterparts. They tend to be smaller with light brown feathers, and they have a similar appearance to the nightingale. Now, birds of paradise tend to be solitary in nature and come together to mate. A female bird of paradise will lay an egg in a nest, and what's really cool about the birds of paradise, unlike other bird species, is that they can have a nest on the ground, in the trees, or in dense foliage. Birds of paradise chicks typically hatch within 20 days but the incubation period differs amongst different species. The birds of paradise chicks are often born with no feathers, but some hatchlings have a few. Newly born birds of paradise chicks can't walk or stand and rely on mama bird to find food. Now birds of paradise chicks usually leave mom's nest as young as a month old. They grow up so fast. There are around 50 different birds of paradise species, from the king bird of paradise, which is the smallest, measuring at about 5.9 inches, to the largest bird of paradise, the curl-crested manicode, which is about 17 inches. Many birds of paradise species are extremely rare and are only found in certain places and particular habitats. Many birds of paradise species feed on fruit and berries found in the canopy of the jungle. Some species of birds of paradise are partial to eating insects, while others favor a particular species of spider. <clears throat> These birds also have their wannabes. The South African bird of paradise isn't a bird at all. It's actually a member of the banana family. It sports a beautiful flower that's supposed to resemble the avian in flight. It's just like the traveler tree which is named after me. I don't see the resemblance. The IUCN currently lists the birds of paradise as least concern. Adult birds of paradise have very few natural predators in the wild. The more vulnerable birds of paradise chicks are preyed upon by large birds of prey as well as odd snakes. The main predator of the birds of paradise are the humans that live in the settlements of the same habitat. Birds of paradise are also continually being threatened by deforestation and loss of habitat. Thanks for checking us out this week, travelers. If you liked the video, give us a like and tell us your favorite fact about the birds of paradise in the comments below. And if there's an animal or conservation effort that you want us to spotlight, make sure to email us at asktravstravels at gmail.com. If you want to learn more about the first record of Birds of Paradise or their popular 1990s TV appearance, make sure to check out travstravels.org or visit our Facebook page. Finally, if you want to be the first to know about a new video we post, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Keep on traveling and it's great to have you back. I am Trav. I am Traveler Tree. I am Groot. I am Trav. I am Traveler Tree.